<laughs> Alright, time to start recording like a vlog right now while I eat. And also, uh, <laughs> just use my computer because I don't know. I don't feel like going. Straight to talking, like, just sitting here and talking. Instead, I'm just gonna mess around and hopefully have something to talk about. I don't know. Because I <laughs> having not really much of a uh, log mood at all. Did a lot of progress on the Steam account. Um, <laughs> went up a bunch of levels, like on the Steam account actually, because you can like raise levels to actually improve your profile or something. I figured out that by earning more levels, you can get like badges from the games you play mostly that require cards and the way I found <laughs> while getting those cards is that you can actually like bar buy the cards for a cheap price on Steam around you just need to go through a few clicks to actually find a way to get those cards and yeah <laughs> they're not that expensive I mean they're a lot more expensive than you buy for, from the games and yeah, I went up a bunch of levels because I didn't care. Like, I got money on, on my Steam wallet. And yeah, I pretty much raised my freaking profile to 10. And I thought, well, this is going to be good enough for for the time being. Did a lot of bloggers. I'm, I'm actually like on Steam quite a lot, actually. I like, for example, on Borderlands 2, like since like, I don't know, a few months now. When I bought the game, I've clocked in 146 hours onto the game. It's my most played game right now, and I'm still playing it for the sake of getting like an achievement for one of the characters. As in, like more specifically for Zero's achievement. I'm more aiming for, towards that, or just simply, which is mostly just me playing for the game normally because. Uh, I would need like at least I think level 30 to actually get the achievement I need to actually um, or the skill I need to actually like get the achievement so going through the progress of that and yeah so far so good I'm um, a lot of a lot of games as well like Resident Evil 4 PhD version is all right it's pretty much Resident Evil but on PC with slightly improved like um, controls and mechanics and um, visuals of course because it's an HD one HD version of Resident Evil 4 they improved it Capcom um, <laughs> let's see um, it's right I clocked in 44 hours on Steam because like only 44 hours because like well Beforehand, I couldn't actually buy the game, so I had to like pirate it, sue me, and um, yeah, so far 44 hours on it. Um, I could play, I, I might play a bit more of it, but still, slowly but surely. Finding of Isaac, I now have an actual version of it once again because of you know the Troy example I explained. Got Planes vs. Zombies again with that, eh? Hey, Anchor Video Game Nerd Adventures, um. I played it a bit, I don't know, I just couldn't like get myself into it just yet. Probably because it's actually pretty difficult to get for Ford Racing 3, oh man. Yeah. I bought this game a bunch. Like uh before I bought the Steam version. Um because like back and forth, like the disc like on my previous PC, like the Windows XP one, the it wouldn't work so I had to either throw it away or whatever I actually did it twice like I bought both two versions of it hoping for, to actually have one version to work fairly uh, for some reason I the second one I couldn't get there I wish I did because like after like uh, one or two years I when I got Windows 7 this would work normally and uh, the next time like I got it before the same version was like a Actually, this is the third one, but I didn't technically buy it. I got it like pirated as well. Beat it 100%. Now I'm playing for it again and now bought it off of Steam. So, yeah, there's that. 
two minute anniversary. I also have that one. I actually like play from tried it with a friend. Didn't beat it, but I tried it out a bit. It's pretty cool at the time, yeah. And a lot of other stuff DLC extra, as in like Borderlands 2 Headhunter 4 Wedding Day Massacre. Pretty much big moxies, like sort of this mini. Um, mini DLC mission or whatever that you can try out on a different map. It's pretty interesting here. You also get like dialogue from your own character, each having their own individual ones. The weirdest one I heard is like from Zeros. I tried them out. I tried two accent and Zero, and like Zeros is a lot more stranger because this was like right after the main game. They did the voice acting, and for some reason. Zero's like dialogue doesn't really sound as right. The individual ones in the in the DLC mini map or whatever, like he sounded a lot more mellow. I don't know. It kind of bothered me. <laughs> I expected a bit more, way more close to like from the main game, but eh, I don't know. Still pretty cool, but yeah, I like the accents a lot more so far. Not sure how the other two characters or four technically from the Game of the Year edition, like you know, with Gage and Craig. But yeah. I'm not gonna upload the whole vlog or whatever on this. It's because I'm more planning to actually cut a lot more of this. I felt like talking a lot more. I just stuff a lot more personal stuff, but I don't know, I just couldn't like drive the talking a bit yet. I don't know. <laughs> like, I don't know, I guess the difference between the real world me or and the me right now in this room while I talk in English. Well, I guess I can. I don't know. It's not like I plan to upload the whole thing. I can just scrap this out. Plan on like more combining and cutting a lot of them into a, like a one single video of, indi of individual rants or uh, things that of the happening. I don't know. <laughs> Like, hmm. the difference between the the me right now, the English talking inside this room, internet using or computer using me, is a lot more different than from the real me. Because I just kind of more go for the native lang my native language, Lithuanian, with the exception of my best friend. And XLR, which I call him now because I don't know, I feel more comfortable doing it. It's not really XLR, it's like more such with an M name, but I just call him as XLR for the vlogs or whatever, the videos. Because we just go back and forth on the talking native and English, it's pretty weird. It's kind of our own tradition or thing going on. while we hang out <laughs> and um, the real me I use my native language and I'm a lot more silent than here like I mean sure with the less plays and the vlogs I tend to talk a lot more but that's because I don't know I feel like a lot more comfortable I'm in my comfort zone like this area or whatever or like when I'm just by myself because I'm too, I'm really afraid of talking to people. I'm really shy, like, I'm, I wouldn't say more shy, but I'm more introverted. I'm a big introvert, like, um, and I'm also like a really big coward, like, man. Like, especially currently now, it's like, I, I don't know. Like for examples of school or just like with family or whatever. I tend to speak a lot less or not get into the conversation a lot more because I don't know. I'm just not really that interactive with people. I don't know. I just I'm just always scared of doing talking like anything about it because I don't know. I just feel dumb about stuff. I'm not brave. I'm just like a big coward. On everything. 
like on my ambitions, my future, my freaking conversations, the people I meet, the uh, freaking school. I'm just a freaking coward, man. I mean, the reason I just do like art on DeviantArt and Tumblr, mess around on Tumblr and YouTube with less plays and sometimes vlogs is because like, I don't know, I just want a hobby like many hobbies to like take up the time so I want to worry like constantly about my cowardice or whatever I don't know it's just like I don't know I just take up whatever I'm inter interested in like gaming cycling which like I'm currently not doing that much right now because many mechanical issues with the bike um gaming because like I grew up with gaming for as long as I can remember honestly um videos because I like watching videos and I want to make my own videos <laughs> and well sometimes like I j more gaming center answer because I'm not ambitious about other things <laughs> again with a cowardly thing with the coward thing of doing other stuff especially more ambitious ones like I'm planning on doing an everything long, like, I'd say two everything long videos, but I'm just, like, not really into it because I'm constantly bored, and I'm, and I'm bad at starting out at those kinds of things, because I don't know. <laughs> so, I don't know, I just do things that make me feel comfortable. It's just more that way, and with English, it's like... I'm just really fascinated with like English it, because like I don't know I, it just sounds nice and it's like I wanted to keep improving <laughs> my conversations while in English because I don't know I just like really like it and just there's just so many cool stuff that is that is made by like you know Americans um, Great British or whatever you know English centered people because like I know it's like the biggest I want to say like industry industry wise it's like more content they're like the biggest like amount and like the best I've seen is like English and I want to like ex enjoy to the fullest with it with the language because like I don't know it's just real like and that's and it's also because like Lithuania stuff especially currently I don't have any interest in it and it's like I can't think of anything to get like into really with the language like with just speaking or like writing I don't know I just couldn't get into it either it's like too dull or boring or it's like it's not an interest I don't have an interest in it either or e even if I do I just couldn't really like it just feels different I couldn't like further delving more engulf into the freaking um, content of it so I don't know <laughs> if I w had a lot more bigger interest in my own native language stuff I would would be a lot more braver on like talking and like conversation with other people I mean younger I was like everything was still new and I was a lot used to like Lithuanian but now it's like I'm a lot more used to English and I'm having a lot of troubles with Lithuanian stuff. I don't know. It's just a big, big mess. And I just mostly like stay silent and just not bother delving into it because I'm a big coward again. I don't know. <laughs> and it's the reason why I'm good at talking like this, even though I'm from Lithuania and not like born and raised in Lithuania and even in the born and raised in the same city and even I'm a, I was raised in like an Eastern Europe part Eastern Eastern part of Europe too where the accent is a lot is a lot more awkward but I don't know my ambition on improving my English is like it kept improving and improving and now I'm just a lot more fluent on talking English and I feel a lot more comfortable 
with it. So, <laughs> I don't know. It just happened. I just, the more I got into it, the, the more better I got with some consequences, of course, like I said previously, you know, with other stuff. With my other language, so yeah, and even and also with French, I couldn't get into it in the slightest. I'm sorry the, for the French because, like, I don't know, it's like it's it's just not appealing to me, it really isn't. I mean, I had to like take a second foreign language in my school, so like, and my choices like were either freaking. Russian or French and I just chose French because Russian is for communists is what I thought I mean not totally like now I, I would think it's just more I don't know I just it's, Russian doesn't appeal to me as well as the language and French was like It was said like it, it sounded similar to English in a sense not by accident it's just more there's some film familiarities to it, so I chose that and just, I don't know. I got to start from it, but then it just, I don't know, it, I lost interest and I'm just stuck with it until the this year ends. I'm in 12th grade and I'm just hoping for it to like, everything to be freaking over. And I would be pretty happy to actually like leave my, my current school behind because it's a freaking mess for me. It's like lots of toxic stuff around people. I mean, the toxic stuff is not directed at me, it's just more surrounding me. I'm surrounded by toxicity. Is that even a word? I don't know. It's just filled with that. And the more I... The more I listen to that, the more, like, I don't know. Part of my faith in humanity <laughs> uh, gets lost, I don't know. And I just have more groans, a lot more um, sad thoughts, I don't know. And I guess the reason I also find English is because they're, I have an interest in the English language is because the people that use it, what I found, are a lot more nicer than here. Well man, maybe that's mostly because of history and uh, freaking relationship, relationships with the, with other countries and other ethnic groups, yeah, it's complicated. I don't like the people in this country. <laughs> in general, I'm not, no specific, it's just in general. I don't like, I don't know, there's just a lot, uh, it's more prone to toxicity than I see in, in English ones, English speaking people, I don't know. I mean, there is a lot of flaws with English speaking people, but over here, in this country, there's also flaws of it too, but I don't know. Both have their own major flaw flaws, but I don't know. The English speaking people's pros, I suppose, are a lot more higher, bigger, and better than in this country, so there you go. <laughs> like I said, it's a mess, and I don't like it. The more I like hear it, I don't want to repeat myself, it's just more, the more I get into it, it just pushes me away. Instead of just pulling me, it's just like more driving me away. Overall. New New for Speed game is coming out, oh yeah. And like, it already came out like for PS4 and Xbox on like, I think November 3rd? Or November 5th, I can't remember. But for the PC version, it won't come out until spring of 2016. I'm not kidding. It's stupid, but I guess they're planning on doing other stuff for the Need for Speed game, the EA and the Need for Speed group. The Need for Speed guys. So, I don't know. It's kind of like with the GTA 5 thing. It's like, first they got get the main game out for the consoles and do more stuff, more coding or whatever for the PC version because I don't know with GTA and like Need for Speed I guess the PC version is the more superior one in terms of possibility so yeah. and also with more resolution and graphics and changes and stuff so yeah yeah
So many photos from the tweets. I mean, I could read them, but I'm just afraid. Well, I, I do read them, but I'm just more afraid of, like, speaking for it. Well, like, like check these because I don't intend to. That's what I usually do. Um, it's more like whispering to myself of what it's said. So, yeah. <laughs> Oh boy, one of the the uh, one of the people I'm following is, is trying out Undertale fully, and it's uh, yeah, <laughs> it's pretty cool. I mean, eh, I've heard quite a bit about Undertale. Like a lot of people love it. There's like it has its own fandom now. I mean, I might try it out one day, but I don't know. I just not interested. I'm interested in other games. I'm interested in Borderlands 2, 4, Racing 3, and possibly Terraria. So. Sorry, <laughs> maybe some other time, but I will. <laughs> okay, <laughs> that's pretty interesting. Uh, I mean, I could show it. Uh, I mean, it's gonna look weird because my hand would be all shaky, but eh, I'll try. So, fun with P with the pH of under eleven, not basic. I'll just keep it steady. <laughs> you see the heads, man, it's like in a completely different spot and how the camera is angled. <laughs> yeah. And the pun. So, <laughs> I don't know. I think it's pretty cool. Aesop Science, like, brings out a lot of, like, really cool tweets. <laughs> and I, like, like retweet them a bunch. So, <laughs> that one was pretty cool. I'm good. I might even retweet that. Fuck it. <laughs> That's really cool. Huh. <laughs> uh, I might need to check that video after this <laughs> because I don't know one of the people like made it like a tutorial video for art and I want to check that out and of course I have an interest in art so I don't know might be fun <laughs> oh yeah I also like upload a bunch of comic zone soundtracks if you have noticed that because I don't know I'm just more trying not to get some views get some attention in a different way other than my current videos because it's not working I will admit but it's like I don't know I want to try something and so far not so good but maybe eventually I'll gain some recognition of this of these and maybe it'll get me somewhere in terms of views so yeah. here's something I don't know, I kind of ran out of things I want to talk about. I pretty much got out everything I wanted to say. <clears throat> Except, I'm not doing that great on the freaking... <laughs> um, on, in school, I don't know, it's just every day is like a shitty experience, I don't know. It's... It's just crappy, and I'm just trying to, like pass forward without that much thought which I really shouldn't is but it's just like with the school it's like I can't do anything about it it's just shit and that's it I just have to deal with the last year and hopefully to work out for the future and well for the best for the future I don't know more like it temperature wise and what I'm like checking the weather is like uh, very cloudy, or overall cloudy. As you can like see right now, it's like it's really like like dark and temperature wise. Uh, by the way, this is on uh Celsius, not Fahrenheit. <laughs> if it would be on Fahrenheit, it would be really freaking cold right now. But yeah, just a bunch of stuff. Pretty much similar temperature. Not too hot, not too cold. Pretty average, very cloudy. If you like this weather, then you're in for a treat, I suppose. 40 minutes, wow. <clears throat> yeah, definitely cutting this one. <laughs> I mean, I didn't even have an intro for this. I'm not planning on giving it anything an intro here. I'm just more just gonna splice up a bunch of parts, whatever. So, I don't know. I guess that should be it. I'm just gonna go now, mess around on gaming and on posts and uh probably oh play some games maybe maybe did i say that i don't know 
Either way, um, that's, that should be it for today. I might try again tomorrow, but I don't know. So I'll see you later, I guess, me or the viewers, because I might upload this video or I may not. Who knows? So, see ya.